James Lynch here from Middle Easy. Happy to be joined by Myro Bueno Silva, who will be taking on Holly Holm in the main event of UFC Fight Night, July 15th. Myra, how are you? Good. Perfect. Very happy. <laughs> Good. I bet you're happy. How excited were you when you found out you'd be fighting Holly Holm, especially after that fight with Misha Tate fell through? Yeah. When uh, Misha injury, I mean, cry too much. <laughs> but when uh, oh, yay. Do you want a main event with Holly Holm? But, wow, I mean, very badly. Excellent, excellent. Um, were you surprised to get this fight, or were you expecting a, a big opponent like this? Uh, I'm not surprised because uh, I worked hard for seven years. Now I'm top 10, she's top three, but I'm no, uh, no surprise because I work hard in now UFC. UFC, look that. <laughs> Yeah, they, they certainly have. Um, and the other bit of news that's happened uh, before this fight, you have new management. You're with First Round. How did that all come together? How did you sign with First Round? Yeah. First round. Yeah. Uh, yeah. We 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 we, we uh, work together for this fight for a long for a long time. I think the, uh, for sponsorships, for for mediums, for other things. I think it's a good idea for First Round. Uh, 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 it's a, a great company. Excellent. That, that's great. And uh, like I mentioned there, you're fighting Holly Holm. How do you feel like you match up against Holly in this fight? Uh, how do you look at this fight from a style perspective? Yeah, Holly Holm is a great fighter as a, as a, a former champion. If you have one person can stop and girls, this division, this girl is Holly Holm. But now it's my time. Now it's my moment, understand? And I go, I go knock out, I, I will knock out her. I love it. That's great. Uh, what about training camp? Uh, where are you training for this fight and who have been some of your main training partners? Uh, I train ATT in the Coconut Creek. I train with Kayla Harrison, Gloria De Paula, uh, my head coach is Pahumpa. Uh, it's great partners here. I'm very happy. I'm, I'm ready for this, uh, for this moment. How, how much confidence do you get training an American top team with so many high level fighters? Uh, training America top team is a hundred percent for a comfort level for me because uh, I trained with Kayla Harrison. She's two times uh, uh, Olympic judo. This uh, her mental is the best mental for this game, you know. And then I'm very excited for July 15. Yes, that, that, that's awesome. Um, and how about the weight cut? When will you start cutting weight for the fight? Um, uh, well, I'm fighting but, uh, in flyweight. It's more hard. Now uh, I'm in more, I'm, I'm, I, I stay in my weight. I lose, I lose uh, uh, um, a little, a little weight. And then I'm more, more happy in the, the fight week. I'm more strong and, and happy. Excellent. Um, now, do you just do your training camps at ATT or do you live in Florida now? Yeah, I, uh, I live. Uh, I I I live in here now. I live. Okay. Uh, I I'm stay here for eight months. I think I I I is gonna. I go. I, I stay here for my for a long time. I love that. I love I love Florida. I love uh, I love ATT. I love my partners. Uh, I love my life here. That's great. How much does it help having other Brazilian fighters at the gym? There's a lot of Brazilians at American Top Team. Exactly. <laughs> Florida is like Brazil in America, yeah. you know? and then uh, too much Brazil Brazilian peoples here. Uh, Sakai is here. Sakai is my brother. Gloria is coming here with me. Uh, Gloria is my wife. Uh, Pezão, uh, Parumpa, Anderson, who's the Oliveira brother, is my 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 work my my coach. Yeah, workout. Standard condition is Brazilian. Uh, I think it's Brazilian. Uh, a little Brazilian American. It is, yes, for sure. Um, and uh, you're, you're, who will be in your corner for this fight? Um, uh, Gloria, <laughs> Pahumpa, uh, I think it's Anderson, the, uh, uh, oh, the Oliveira brothers, I think so. Okay, great. That's good. And you, you said a knockout. When do you see yourself knocking out Holly? What's your prediction for the fight? I think that uh, the third round, th third round. I okay. think, I think, I don't know, but I train for this. I train for a big show, a big show in the July 15. And of course, at the top of your division, there's the big uh, title fight this Saturday with Amanda Nunes and uh, Irene Aldana. Who do you see winning that fight? 
I'm a my big fan. I'm Amanda fans. I think Amanda in the first round. Oh, really? Okay, excellent. Yeah, she's uh, definitely favored in the fight. Um, and and if you do, if you knock out Holly Holm, that would be a huge win for you. Where does that put you in the division? Do you think? If not, I will. <laughs> okay, <laughs> fair enough. You're right. You're right. You said you said you will. When when I knock out her, I am next to uh, I, I'm next for for belt. Okay, there we go. Is that we have to need a new face? Understand? You know? Yes, I do understand. Yeah, you, they they need they need new uh, new 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 bodies. I agree. As the bantamweight division, no one more see Amanda and Penny, Amanda Penny, so Amanda Penny, Amanda. No, stop. The, the, the division need a new face. I am a new face. I love it. That that's great. And uh, has the UFC given you any indication that you will be next? Like, have you spoken to the UFC about if you win this fight, you will get the next title shot? No, 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 no. We we don't talk about this. But uh, in the July 15, I go in the press on everybody. Um, I am a new champion, believe me. Trust me. And is this fight part of a new contract? Or are you still on your other UFC contract? No, this is a new contract. Oh, congratulations. I, four fights, I would think? No, no, I have more fights. I have, uh, I, think, I think, five fights. Oh, congratulations. Thanks. Well, that's got to feel good. I work hard for this moment, for this... For this opportunity have you had a chance to in uh you know soak all this in with the fact that you've moved to florida you're, you're getting these big opportunities like and and you get this new contract have you been able to enjoy that at all yeah not yet not yet because uh i uh when the the, the things um happened fast. Uh, uh, happen fast too much and uh, misha injury holly home main event new contract and Teddy position is fast too much for me, but uh, I work hard. Yeah, I stay in the Florida for a long time. Yeah, that's great. Um, how did your English get to be so good? Uh, you're, 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 I know you're having a bit of help with the translation, but your English is is really well spoken. How did you learn English? Yeah, I improve my English, but it's hard because here's uh, Brazil for me. <laughs> I talk right. to Brazilian people. But I improve my English for respect to every fans, uh, American fans, and then I think I need to improve more for respect for for you, for everybody like me, and wanna wanna listen my me talk with you with you. Well, your English is great, and and it's ama- It's really cool that we can do this interview. Um, do you watch any American movies or television to help with your English? Yeah, of course. I I talk sometimes. I talk with Kayla. I talk Michelle. Michelle is from uh, Australia. It's different English, and then uh, right. I improved. I improved my English when I I I, I live in, I I, I move for him for her for him. So Tiago Moises, who's at your gym, did you know that when him and I first started doing interviews, he could barely speak English, and now he's almost fluent. Did you know that? Yeah. Yeah, but uh, Thiago is a good person. Is a is a, is a, uh, a good model for me, for me and for me to folks because uh, Thiago Moisés is a great fighter, is a great person, and she improve everything in your game, your life. Yes, that's true. Um, did you watch the UFC main event last weekend between Kai Kara France and Amir, Amir Albazi? Yes, I watch and I don't like it. Both the main event, but I don't like it because <laughs> it's my card with Misha. Do you know? Yeah, but, oh, that's right. Yeah. But it's okay. I, um, I, this fight, I don't watch, but I, I watch every, every, uh, every fight uh, before because my brother, Daniel Willy Cat, fight, fought, and then I watch. Okay. That, that makes sense. Um, and have you been watching The Ultimate Fighter at all with Conor McGregor? Yes, ma'am. I love that man. This man uh, is unbelievable. This this is word for, for, for Conor McGregor. Unbelievable. Um, do you think his fight with Michael Chandler will happen? No. No. I don't think so. I think, oh. uh, I think, I think all their fights for Conor. Okay. Interesting. Big star in the UFC. I think Chandler is no good fight for 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 Connor now. Okay, that that makes sense. And what about downtime? Uh, do you get to go to the beach at all since you're in Florida? Yes, yes. I, uh, I'll do weekend. I'll do weekend. I go to the the 
the the feel that that uh, that the vibe that vibe I love I love beach I love pool uh, I love room the beach yeah that's great what what else do you like doing when you're not training I love uh, cooking I love make cooking to cook I love to cook and room room is my 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 um, my favorite my favorite thing. Okay, uh, go for a run. You mean like go for a jog? Yeah, exactly. Jog. Okay. Okay, great. Like that, that. That. <laughs> What's your favorite meal to cook? Brazilian, Brazilian food. I love everything. I love everything. Uh, but my favorite is uh, chicken, chicken rice. Chicken and rice. In Brazil, okay. have, in, Brazil in my in my in my city, have one thing called mayonnaise. Mayonnaise. Yeah, mayonnaise. I love that. Okay, interesting. So is that that's your favorite dish you like making for people? Yeah, exactly. I, okay, that's great. I love to do this. Sure. Excellent. Maria, thank you so much for doing this. And thank you to uh, whoever is off camera for translating. I appreciate it. It's uh, UFC Fight Night coming up here July 15th. Uh, Maria, if there's anyone you'd like to thank before we get out of here, any sponsors or any social media you want to mention, I'll give you the last word. Oh, only, only uh, appreciate ev everybody. Thank you so much for all the support. I promise to give a big show in July 15th. I promise for everybody. Okay. Don't blink. <laughs>